Hi everyone, welcome back for another video. This is gonna be my nighttime routine. How I get ready for bed and enjoy a peaceful night's sleep. So it's currently 6.37 p.m. I just came back from the gym and tip number one to have a great night's sleep. Wear yourself out. I had a great gym session. I did legs and core, a lot of supersets and reps, quick, fast, and then I did a good 2.5 miles on the treadmill. So I have clocked in over 10,000 steps today and I am well exhausted or at least fatigued ready for a good night's sleep. So my next tip for a great night's sleep is to start early. It's still light outside and I'm going to get ready for bed. The point of doing this is so you can have a peaceful wind down. The goal is not to start rushing at the end of the night. You wanna start early, give yourself time to wind down, relax and rest. And what also happens when you start your night time routine early is that you have a little bit more time to do extra things such as greasing your scalp or doing a little extra skincare, even, you know, buffing your feet or getting a shave in. When you start early, you have a bit more wiggle room and time to focus on yourself instead of cramming and feeling so exhausted that you just wanna do the basic minimum and get it over with. So I'm gonna head to the shower now, especially after my sweaty gym sesh. Gym sesh, yeah. We use words like adorbs, woohoo. So for my shower routine tonight, I am going to be using this Vagisil. This is the Sensitive Sense Daily Intimate Wash in Peach Blossom, the nicest peach you can ever find. I love doing a base cleanse with Vagisil because for one, it's pH balanced, which means that it's essentially acidified. Um, that means it's low on the pH scale, so it neutralizes odors all over the body and it is gentle because it's an intimate wash. I love Vagisil for my entire body. I find it neutralizes armpit odors, under bosom odors, all those nicks and crannies, especially in the summer and um, you know warm weather time. Get you a bottle of Vagisil, especially as your base cleanse before you know you go in with a more fragranced wash. Just saying, I'm just saying. And what's great is I can use it from neck to foot. Ooh, and on your feet too, neutralizes. Just a little tip, like if you want to neutralize odor, find a pH balanced body wash or soap. And since I have time, because I'm starting early on my nighttime routine, this is my scrub of the night. Usually I scrub when I just have a little extra me time. This is the Dr. Teal Shea Sugar Scrub and the citrus scent. This is like a wake up scent, but feel free to use a more soothing scent. I love this. I love the texture, consistency comparable to Tree Hut. And since we're on a little tropical kick, I have been loving Tree Hut's Coco Colada Shea Body Butter. I've been loving all of Tree Hut's Shea Body Butters. And at this point, I can say if I were to take one body product with me on a secluded island somewhere, it would be this. It would be all of Tree Hut's Body Butters. It's light, it is whipped. I'm almost finished with this. It is lightly fragranced, but the fragrance lasts long on the skin. It makes my skin supple, healthy, bouncy, plump, and it's not heavy, which is the key. I usually avoid butters because of the heaviness. I don't experience it with that. So I'm gonna start the stripping process <laughs> and take a shower. spray. This is my nighttime deodorant. I can't stand the smell, but I'm trying to use it up. And I make a generous amount under the pits. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, time for some skincare. 
So in the shower, I washed my face with Burst Gel Cleanser, 60 seconds with my silicone brush. Now I'm going to use the Micellar Cleansing Water. I actually love using that as a toner. What it does is it cleans up all the dirt that may have been left back. And that happens a little often actually because I use such a mild cleanser. So this step has been giving me some of the clearest skin because it truly cleans my face. Let that dry down a bit. Then I actually like to go in with my eyelash serum. This is the Luxrose Advanced Eyelash Serum. I like to put it on before I clog my skin up with other products. And I love this lash serum. I get it from Amazon. This is my fourth bottle. And I like to use some of my brows. This has given me some of the, the best lashes I've ever had in my life. Okay. I like to squint. To, I like to squint so it goes to the bottom lashes. Okay, so that's dried down a bit. And I go in with my serum. Tonight I am going to be mixing my serums. This is the Cetaphil Deep Hydration Serum. I love how bouncy this makes my skin. And I'm going to be mixing it with the Urban Skin RX Even Tone Super Glow Serum. This has 10% L-ascorbic acid and kojic acid. This by itself is a little too harsh for my skin. I have kind of sensitive skin, um, but mixing these two allows this to work without being too abrasive. So what I do is I take two pumps and four to five drops. Rub it. Pat. What this serum does is it gives me really clear skin and it has um, anti-aging, antioxidant properties. So that's good. I've been loving that combo and perfect to do on a self-care night. So once that has absorbed a bit, this is my Cetaphil Healthy Radiance Renewing Cream. This is okay, I like it. I'll finish it up and move on to Versed. I like that it doesn't affect my skin. Cetaphil has been doing a great job at not breaking me out. I actually just use it as an eye cream as well. When you have a little bit more time in your routine, you're able to do an eye cream or do a sheet mask, do gua sha or some mouth exercises. <laughs> And that's the skincare done. Taken off the menu. It's 717 and we don't have to worry about getting in the shower, doing my skincare, lotion, all of that's taken care of. Now we can move on with the night. This is an Amazon exclusive. <laughs> this is from Amazon. If you're interested, I'll link it down below. I am a nightgown girl. I love nightgowns. I don't like shorts. I don't like pants. I don't like long sleeves, I like sleeveless. I like silky preferably over cotton. Curious, what do you sleep in? Are you a nightgown lady, a pajama lady? Are you a boy shorts and tee lady? Are you a nudist? Let me know down below in the comments how you sleep, what you sleep in, what's your garb for the night? So a tip number three for a peaceful wind down is to eat light. So I'm coming from the gym, I haven't eaten yet, I had only a protein shake, and I'm actually gonna go ahead and have a salad for the night. And I'm gonna have my favorite. This is the Taylor Farms Bacon Caesar Chopped Kit. I get these from Walmart. This is my favorite salad kit ever, I've ever tried. So, yeah. It comes with 
romaine lettuce, cheese, garlic, crouton, crumbles, Parmesan cheese, uncured bacon. The bacon is what makes it with Caesar dressing. And to be a little more healthy, I bought this to add to it. This is the organic spinach and spring mix. dig into my salad I'm gonna head into tip number four is to get your magnesium in my optimizers has created one of the most complete magnesium supplements on the market did you know that over 80% of individuals are not meeting their magnesium requirements and magnesium is one of those essential supplements that you need to function properly magnesium helps with mood support it helps with anxiety it helps with digestion and it helps with sleep support so if you're finding that you're not getting proper sleep, you may want to look into Bioptimizer's Magnesium Breakthrough. They have seven components within their supplement to make it one of the most absorbable magnesium supplements out there. Like, it's just doing the damn thing. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pop two before my meal, swallow it down, let it sit a little bit, get to work. And it also helps with digestion, so anything in that salad is going to be properly absorbed as well. I found myself having a bit of issues absorbing the nutrients from my food, so I also take other supplements, but the magnesium is going to help me digest and help me sleep soundly. If you're interested in the magnesium breakthrough, go ahead and check the link below and use this code right here to save 10% off on your next purchase with Bioptimizers. I'm the supplement queen, so I know what I'm talking about, okay? If you're looking for some great sleep, get some magnesium into your diet. And Bioptimizers has some of the most complete supplements out there. I love their blood sugar breakthrough and the magnesium is new, but I've been loving it. Helps me sleep soundly. So let's get that in right now. I'm gonna take it down with this Bolt House Farms Green Immunity Boost Juice. Any way I could get my vegetables in, I do so. And this is made of pineapple, cucumber, apple, ginger, and kale. That's the blend if you ask me. Great to stay hydrated before bed as well. Not too hydrated so you wake up through the night and pee, but hydrated. The directions say to take two capsules with your evening meal. Perfect. Enjoy a warm drink or hot. So you saw me just make a cup of tea. This is the honey lavender stress relief tea and a honey chamomile tea and together they blend to make 
honey herb deliciousness that is perfect for winding down at night. Something about hot drinks at night tells your body it is time to lay down, it is time to rest. And the magnesium is kicking in and I feel like I'm floating. <laughs> Loading on cloud nine. So I read that stress causes you to urinate out more magnesium, leaving us depleted. And Westerners are some of the most stressed beings on the earth. So you could imagine how depleted we are of magnesium. But I realized while sitting watching 90 Day Fiance and Bilal and his foolishness, how just pleasant I felt watching it. I pray for Shahida, okay? But... I like this magnesium, I really do. If you feel yourself a little stressed and looking to wind down for that, I highly recommend the Bioptimizers Magnesium Breakthrough, they work. And then we head into tip number six, which is to journal at night. I know they say journal in the morning, it's best to start the day fresh, but there's nothing better than getting the day's thoughts out of your mind before hitting the pillow. Lately, I've been journaling a lot at night, especially when I don't have my kids with me. I like to reflect back on the day, think about anything that I absorbed and want to release, and the pages of my journal are where I do that best. If you move the thoughts from your head onto paper that's called energy transference. Just like how you vent to a person, vent to the book. It'll accept it and it won't need a meal. It won't judge you. It'll just accept it. <laughs> So I'm gonna take the time. I can either A, do a list of 10 items I am grateful for and why, B, just do a three page entry of how I feel, um, what's going on with me, and um, anything that I just want to reflect back on. What am I gonna do today? This book is from Target, by the way. I love the Green Room brand. They are hardcover spiral notebooks and they have um, a decent college rule but they are not as big as a regular college rule notebook and they're not small, like a little journal. So it's a great happy medium. I love these. This is my second one from Target. I think I'm gonna go ahead and do gratitude. When I tell you that magnesium has me so even keeled, like I can't, like all I wanna do is give thanks. I have nothing to like vent about. I just wanna thank the Lord for his blessings. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a list of 10 things and feel a sense of gratitude before I lay my head to rest. So tip number seven to create my ideal nighttime routine and get some good sleep. It's going to be putting on binaural sleep beats. If you're a person that is able to listen to things while sleeping, I am. I previously used to listen to rain, a little annoying. And then I discovered binaural beats and usually they have subliminal messages underneath the overtone. So I will connect my iPad to this Bluetooth speaker I have this is from Walmart and it's their on brand I'll link it down below if you're interested I love this thing it has great volume power on so I go to YouTube and um, this one was actually one I, I was listening to and you know my feelings were hurt the page is called mind in unison mend your broken heart and be happy they have a list of subliminal affirmations so while the beats playing affirmations such as these are going to be playing but you can't hear them they're in your subconscious and um, this is the list of subliminal affirmations that play and i just love this one i don't necessarily need it for the affirmations the affirmations are nice in general but the beat is just so peaceful I'm going to finish up my tea, um, put my phone away, and just chill. Putting your phone away before bedtime is important. A lot of us don't do it. We use our phone, you know, until we sleep. But the blue light 
does affect us. Even if it's not blue, the light just affects our sleep patterns. If you want better rest, go ahead and put the phone away at least 30 minutes before bedtime. When I tell you I'm about to knock out, I hope you enjoyed this nighttime routine with me. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to shop by optimizers in the link below. Save 10% on your next order because I'm feeling groovy. If you enjoyed this content, give me a big fat thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more. I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.